Maybe I should have actually checked. The history of L.O. Bean is a very old brand. Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to my channel. I just wanted to review a brand that I feel like it's a brand that it's lost amongst millennials and somewhat amongst um, Generation Z, I believe is the next generation. I'm a millennial, so I really don't know what the next generation is called, but I should be down with the times. But it's it's lost amongst our generation and I feel like it's a brand that it should come back um, not necessarily come back but it, if it was marketed a different way our generation would actually you know purchase more of it so I just wanted to review this brand how I stumble upon this brand so I thrift from time to time and when I used to thrift a lot I always loved looking for high-waisted pants and the high-waisted pants that actually fit my waist to hips to thigh ratio because I say thigh ratio sometimes it fits my hips but not my thighs I have massive legs um, I, I felt like I couldn't find pants that fit in the regular store with the high-waisted the mom jeans wouldn't even work for me because the thigh fits doesn't fit you know well enough for me so I stumbled upon L.O. Bean and I noticed that it fit my waist um I, there was also like old school Levi's as well that also fit me pretty well but now the Levi's doesn't really work um the modern Levi's does not work for me that well but the modern L.O. Bean actually does so if you look for the high-waisted pants or you know um I love high-waisted so I've never really tried the low-rise pants but the high-waisted pants really work for me so I just wanted to do a little review I did purchase some L.O. Bean pants and I also purchased some tops from them which I don't think I've ever purchased tops from them so we're gonna try this together um, so yeah I just wanted to review this brand the the I'm gonna review a pair of jeans that I've bought in the past I think it's been over a year or a year and a half maybe two years I don't really recall but I purchased this a while back and then um, now I purchased another pair of jeans this is my second pair of jeans with them uh, a different wash and I will tell you what the sizes are um, and how they fit me so let's get to it it is packaged with, with this so you just have on here the item its color um, and the size I don't know how this is gonna fit because my size has been fluctuating the past two years with COVID I'm small one year I'm bigger another I believe I got size 8 when it first started with them now I'm ordering a size 14 pants so <laughs> I need to lose some weight I'll show you guys my measurements basically I'll put my weight my height my waist measurement and my hip measurement and my thigh measurement right here for you guys to see so you guys can understand what I mean um, when my waist was smaller uh, and everything else was smaller it fit a little bit better now I'm kind of hitting the thigh limit so I'm gonna just put all of that there and what pants sizes I chose to keep um, because I think I have two sizes here I'm not too sure for the jeans I got a size 12 regular and for the khakis and dress pants I got a size 14 regular I got the navy blue in a size 14 I got the dark cement which is a limited color which is on sale right now and almost out in a size 12 that cement is between a um, like a gray heather gray and a uh, I would say army green so it's, it has like a greenish tint with a grayish look to it um, in a size 12 I got the khakis in a size 
14. I think there might be a lighter color khaki that's almost white, but it's like a cream. I don't know how that's going to work on me, so I didn't choose that color. Um, I got this in size 14. And I got the denim, which is a darker rinse than what I'm wearing right now that I've had for like over two, uh, a year and a half, two years, um, in a size 12. This one I'm on the fence. I, I got this in a size 12 because the ones I'm wearing is a size 10 but is a bit snug. So if this one is too big, then I am still a size 10. Thank you God. Because I've been gaining weight. Like I have nowhere to go. So I need to figure that out. Um, so we'll see. Then I got some shirts. It's been a while since I've tried on some shirts no actually it's been a while since I've tried on new shirts but it's I've never ordered shirts from LL Bean before so we're gonna be figuring this out together I got a size large these shirts are floral um, because I think floral is in for the summer and this is a size large like I mentioned and it's wrinkle free so there's this lighter floral shirt and then there's these navy floral shirt and let's try them on So I am done trying everything on as you saw previously I did some squats so that you guys can see how it stretches in the back because I do have a booty and if things are popping when I bend down to pick something up it doesn't really work and sit well with me so um, I had to do the squats for you um, so let's go through them real quick so for the shirts they seem a bit big I feel like maybe I could have gone down a size I could have actually stuck with my medium size because I think they're made for an older generation which older generation they like a loose fit when it comes to certain things and I guess the shirt is one of them I'm more a person who tucks her shirt in so it might be something I could handle and deal with so I'm on the fence about keeping this size I feel like if I do go smaller like I mentioned earlier maybe my chest area might not fit but we'll have to see on that one in terms of the fabric it says it's wrinkle free so it has like a, a starchy not waxy it doesn't feel wax it just feels very thick and I guess that's good if you don't want to have your shirt you know see-through and all that stuff but both shirts do have that feel where it feels you can even maybe almost hear it it feels um starchy like very stiff and that might be whatever they use to make it wrinkle free um, when I shop also I look at fiber content so this is a hundred percent cotton both of them are a hundred percent cotton it feels like cotton it does not itch and that is something I look for when I shop I do not mind the prints I'm like I said I'm gonna have to tuck it in in order to break it up a little bit because it's a bit too busy for my aesthetic pants I noticed both the size 12 and the size 14 fit in different ways so the size 14 gave me a little bit more room and I'm gonna probably put somewhere here what the measurements according to LL Bean is in terms of pant size and also what my body measurements are so 
size 14 seems to be a comfortable fit I can squat in it without feeling like a button is gonna pop um, it's a, a slightly looser fit it fits if that makes sense there is some pouching so if you need pants that stretch these are not the pants for you these are fit there is no elastic in the waistband or anything for the gray navy color no sorry not navy grayish army green color I got that one in a size 12 like I mentioned earlier but that fit a bit snug I feel like I should not gain any more weight and I should be fine so that's also another thing that I have to think about should I return it because you know I'm anticipating gaining weight or should I just stick with it I might just stick with it because it gives a different look in comparison to the other ones um, it is it's pretty tight it's pretty close to tight and there is no stretch so um, also the pants all of them are 100% cotton so no give 100% cotton no mixing of fibers no lining which is perfectly fine because I don't need anything else to constrain me but they're all high-waisted last but not least the jeans so I showed you guys that I was wearing the lighter pair of jeans and I initially got it in a size 10 all right size 10 at the time when I was smaller was still it still gave me that pouchy part area at, at the bottom of my abdomen so it, it it had some excess fabric but over time after washing and drying and washing and drying for the past two years it fits pretty snug as you could see I could squat there's no stretch um, in these jeans these are a typical mom like jeans but what I love about them is that there's elastic on the sides so the side elastic was what caught me because it helps my waist fit you know it doesn't give a gap a gaping section in the back or in the side it fits me and so that's what I love about the L.L. Bean chains I don't know of any other brand that really does that I think maybe Los Angeles clothing I think that's what it's called and also maybe American Apparel I've never really tried their jeans but I feel like I've seen similar pairs of jeans with them but I don't know L.L. Bean does it for me and this is the darker color my I'll say the pro is the fit the pro is the fit this is a size 14 sorry correction this is a size 12 so size like I mentioned earlier in the pair of jeans that I got from L.L. Bean that I got two years ago I got a size 10 then it was comfortable there was room to play all that stuff now in the new pair of jeans that I got from L.L. Bean which is a darker darker um, color which is another story in itself this one is a size 12 regular and it was comfortable it was not too tight it was pretty you know getting there but it was comfortable nonetheless I feel like the color I don't like the color that much but I feel like if I wash it it will fade out a little bit but there will definitely be bleeding in this color if you wash it with other things so be very careful with this because it looks like it will bleed um, it does have the elastic waistband which I love and you know it still has belt loops like usual but I felt like it was comfortable and it fits so I mean that's it for L.O. Bean I most likely would do other reviews in regards to them I think what I got from this is I'm between sizes so you guys make your judgment like I said they do take returns and they do take exchanges but you would have to pay shipping back which for me was about what ten dollars maybe even less than that and so that's something to also consider uh, the price range was between I think for the shirts 30 something to 50 or 60 for the pants so it's I think it's affordable and it fits well and it's something you guys should explore Thank you guys for tuning into my channel. My name is Iwalade and see you on the next one. Please like and subscribe. Do say.